thug is free. Thank God. Forgot all about that damn doc they kept talking about, which we will get to later. Uh, gentlemen. What we, let's start with that. Congrats. Let's start with congratulations. congrats. Come on, I'll clap yeah, it up man. again for him. Uh, I'm sure his family and loved ones could not be happier. I really enjoyed all of the Mariah the Scientists on her way to Fulton County to pick up thug memes. Those were great. <laughs> they were funny. Those were hilarious. Um, so what happened here? He's got he's sentenced to 40 years, five years time served, 15 years. I'm not reading this. I'm off the dome. 15 years probation, mm -hmm. 20 years on the back end if he violates said probation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. His probation is what? You can't go to Atlanta for 10 years? That was just, that's just no. some of them. Yeah, you can't go to Atlanta for 10 years. He's banned. Mm -hmm. And he's got to do uh, community service. Right, for, for, for community right, service. Per year. And, and I think he's got to do like 100 hours a month. Or 100 something hours. Crazy. And he's got to do some benefit concerts. Yeah. He can go uh, to Atlanta for that. 100 hours a month. Fuck. It was something like no. that. I forgot what it was. We're right, going. We're freestyling. Yeah. But um, he has to see. do four charity events a year. Thug release stipulations. Young Thug can't make gang-related music, is banned from Atlanta for 10 years, and has to do, a, and has to do four annual anti-gang presentations con slash concerts for Atlanta. Young Thug cannot have contact with gang members or co-defendants other than Brother and uh, Gunna. Uh, technically, it's a 40-year sentence, which he had to serve, and I'm getting some act, had to serve uh, the first five years in prison, but commuted to time served, followed by 15 years of probation. Also, there's a backloaded 20 years, we said that, which would be served in custody if he fails probation. All right. That's I mean, it's, I a lot, it's, a lot of <clears throat> it's a lot of wins in there. Like, the, the judge clearly saw what the state was trying to do. And mm -hmm. The judge looked at it as, this is some bullshit. The judge let him keep his passport. Um, judge allowed him to travel for, for music, understands he has other residences, other studios. So they didn't really, um, they weren't as hard on him with the conditions. It would have been hard for them to do that because you can't take away his ability to make a living. And mm -hmm. travel is a part of his ability to do that. I mean, I feel like they could have if they yeah, wanted to, but. It would have been, could fight it. Yeah. I mean, the, first, the, the main thing was what they agreed to or what they were close to agreeing to in the, the plea deal that he was about to make with the state. They were comfortable with him leaving that that same day. Mm -hmm. It was just the conditions that mm -hmm. they couldn't agree yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. And then they try to tell the judge, "Nah, we want him to sit for twenty and all this other stuff." So it's like if you were, and the judge saw through it. it was like, yo, if you were okay with him going home a minute ago, don't try to tell me to keep him there. Mm -hmm. So they said initially they offered him a plea that he did not take, based on just some of the conditions. Mm -hmm. So I guess they went in and fine tuned the conditions, and then they agreed to both sides agreed. But my thing is, no, I'll, no, no, that's not what happened. What happened? It, there was no both sides agreeing. They could not come to the agreement. So he went, he did a non-negotiated plea. Non-negotiated plea is, I'm going to plead guilty to the charges. My team is going to recommend what we think should be the, the penalty mm -hmm. and the state is, and the judge gets to make the decision and we just going to go whatever the oh, judge Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay. They couldn't come to terms. Gotcha. Okay. okay. I think it's a setup. Me personally, I don't necessarily like it. I mean, I a never- A setup for what? To go back. I've never been in a position where I'm sitting in somebody's jail. So I, I, I mean, I've been to jail before, but I haven't been to jail you know, for a long period facing of time. Years. Mm -hmm. And I've been to jail facing life. <clears throat> I think that the 15 year probation, and if you violate any terms in your probation, you go do 20 years, I think it's a setup. Like I know, I don't know all the stipulations to his shit, but a lot of times you can't be around felons. Mm -hmm. If you grew up how we grew up, being around felons is normal, mm -hmm. unfortunately. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? And so some of the stipulations are damn near booby trap for you to go spend 20 years in jail. But that's just the way that, that parole and, pro and probation is really set up is for mm -hmm. a reason, you know, is for you to end up going back. That's my point, tell yeah. me. Though. Shut up. No, for real. This guy, yeah. Go get your glasses. <clears throat> no, I, I, so I just, think, I just think some of that shit is uh, a setup. I think that the state couldn't win, and he can't risk a mistrial, because now if you get a mistrial, we're going to retry you. I don't give a fuck if we got to bring an undercover in here to sit on the jury, you're going to go to jail. Like, I just think he had to take his wins, if they are wins, and just hope to, to be on a, the better side of the law. Not being next. in jail is a win. It, of Huge course, win. a thousand percent. Yeah. A thousand percent. So I said, I can't, I can't judge his decision making. I've never been sitting in jail with my life on the line. And not, not just that. They still allowed him to work, whereas, like, you look at NBA Youngboy or something, he, he can't do shit, can't travel, can't do shows. Like, you have to put a studio in your crib just to, to be able to do any recording. So, it, it, it's, oh, a win. it's it's a win. It's, 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 a, it's a win, even though you know it, it's a trap. Yeah. It is a trap. Like, dog, that that's hard. Fifteen years is hard. Fifteen years is hard for a, a, a square to do without breaking any law. I True. think the trickiest part is they said he can't make gang related music, right? He can't. Yeah, he can't. I think make, that just leaves so much interpretation. It mm -hmm. does. But I mean, I think if you don't go in there and just be mentioning certain shit, you know what I mean? That's obvious. Yeah. Then, then I think he'll be fine. I think that's easy. I think that's the easy part. I think some of the other stuff be the harder part. Again, like being around felons. I don't know necessarily. Um, you know, weed ain't legal in every state. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So you might be in the wrong state with some weed. Now you violated your, your, your parole. Like, I don't know the real fine print. True. I'm just saying, I just look at it like I, there's some potential to be, be real. Eh. 
I agree with you guys' trap sentiment. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. But you, but I, you I, home? I do agree with that. You home? Yeah. No, because I was talking to somebody the other day, and, and they, well, whenever the news broke, and they were like, you know, echoing some of the same things, like, oh, my God, he can't do this, and he can't make gang-related music, and he can't do this, he can't do that. How's he going to live? <laughs> and and the, person, the person was in front of me, like, really stressed. Seriously. Like, dead. <laughs> oh, man, they fucked him. What's he going to do? <laughs> and as I pondered the answer to that, live better than most of Americans in the world. <laughs> most of the people in the world. Yes. I was like, well, he could <laughs> obey the rules of the probation. <laughs> Go live, a, get a legit job, which you have. That pays well. Not be in communication with the people that are shooting at people. <laughs> you already got you a lady. Mm-hmm. Go move to some well, nice, well, quiet town make love songs. with your beautiful model some, singer, some eight thousand square friend, foot shit with a your pool millions and of dollars, and be happy. Mm-hmm. Like, and as I said it, I was like, yo. That sounds so beautiful. Why people don't try to do that from the rip? <laughs> like, yeah. yo, this regular dude shit, and I'm saying that in a box, even, mm-hmm. because he's not a regular dude. Right. But just a normal legal life it's kind ain't of cool. as bad as niggas chopping up to me. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't gonna hold you. When you got some bread, too? That's what I'm saying, right? Yeah. Like, I don't want to be the guy to just, oh, well, where we're from, it's tough to not talk to felons. Yes, I agree with that. It is. But tough times call for tough, tough measures. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yo, you yo, are correct. There was a time Listen. in my life when I could not keep my little young ass away from sail off court. Every time I was up there, shout out my niggas, yeah. But every time I was up there, somebody was getting jumped, beat up, shot, stabbed, selling something. On a, we on a mission. Let's go jump this block. Let's go this. Then one day my mom was like, yo, don't do that anymore. Like, just stop doing that. Like, wait, huh? How? <laughs> How? <laughs> How can I not break in people's houses? <laughs> you just don't. No, for real, man. Like, you don't understand. My livelihood is what I do. Yo, just stop doing it. Mm-hmm. And I just stopped doing it. One day. And, and, life, and life wasn't that bad. It wasn't the worst, is all I'm saying. <laughs> now, I ain't never been in it to the degree of what mm-hmm. some of these charges uh, indicate. But I don't think that young... Th- I do think it's a trap. I do I think, think it's, a, it's trap. a trap. But I, I saw something that said his lawyer wanted to even fight that one. Fight all of that shit. I heard that. But... Guy been sitting in jail for what? It's got to be five years. I'm mm-hmm. assuming that the court keeps a better system than I did. He got time served. He was, mm-hmm. he been he been there for like two and some change. Mm-hmm. But he got time served for five years. Yeah. Mm-hmm. However, that works. Mm-hmm. Yeah, jail okay. math is different from. Got it, got it. Yeah, right. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What I'm saying it's difficult to tell somebody that's been sitting for two and a half years to. No, that even if I fight it, the loss is I could go to jail for. The well, I'll rest still be sitting of mm-hmm. my days, and I'll still be sitting. So 15 out here on parole, yeah. or life. Nah, the easy choice, easy choice. And, and, and my man, my man who got out, who y'all killed and kicked his back in, Gunner. My man got out and and kept the label where it's supposed to be. Put out two monsters. My problems. man came out and kept the music scene. Oh, right, he kept it smoking for me upon my return. Mm-hmm. I just had a nice, good talk with Surf uh, on the phone, on the balcony right now. He sounds great. He's doing great. Good spirits, nice, healthy. But we just spoke about some of the advantages that come with getting a two, three year timeout. To just sit and reflect on what you was doing, how you was doing it, and your for your planning coming out, right? So like he and they, like, yo, we seen a prize piece commercial in here, OG. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> yo, you gonna get you a bag, boy? And I'm stuck in here. I'm coming. I'm coming out. But I'm like, gonna kept this shit rocking. Yes, and now he get to build on the equity of you know the story. You know hip hop. We love a story mm-hmm. of this story and come home. I think if he never rap about a gang again, it's just gonna be fun for his fan base to figure out what he's saying if he put, try to say a riddle, even. <laughs> oh, no, they're gonna be, be trying to the That's gonna be fun. Yeah, fun. gotta be careful. Well, how closely do you think that he's gonna be monitored? I don't know and like, by who? Oh, you know what I mean? Oh, no, they're watching him. Oh, no. Rap team. Oh, no, 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 they're magnifying glasses. And I understand that, but how do you monitor somebody that closely to where you're going to be able to say, oh, you were here at this particular time with this particular person and they're a felon and da 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 da? Like, you know, this is a real question. It ain't that hard. So what are you talking about? Like GPS monitoring and shit no, like that? Because each, that's barely now tracked. each one of us are monitored. And you watch too many docs for this. They fucking track phones. They, they yeah, go to they go to the, the phone. The, is pinging off of something at yeah, all times. they go to the shit in the sky yeah. and see what phone is by what phone. They'll have somebody on you, stake out. 
You in a club, the feds your are car in the club gets with you. somewhere, somebody else's car gets everything around is a tracking Watching device. social media, yeah. he's very famous. It's easy to yeah. someone post a little picture of he's him. He's coming up. home. He's Atlanta's child, mm-hmm. poster child. Mm-hmm. Every restaurant he goes into, people going to be taking pictures. Him and Shorty not going to be able to eat for a year It'll be without very cameras easy and shit to track, in their face. Track yeah, track young, though. That's not, that's not tough. That's okay. not the hardest thing. You think you think people don't know where you at if if you get an eye on you? That's why that's that's the thing that the clout generation be missing, right? Like all the clout is cool, but once the right eye get on you, that eye is on you. Sure, mm-hmm. do with that what you will, but I don't want certain eyes on me at all. Yeah. Right. Uh,